I was looking for a new helmet and I found a helmet this brand spanking new just came out on the market and it's a helmet that you can do everything with you can take to the track you can ride out here on the streets with super lightweight super comfortable I'm gonna tell you all about this helmet stay tuned let's go for a ride watching cycle cruises all on one motorcycle channel subscribe today continue to leave video suggestions but you may find what you're looking for by visiting my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab my videos and those are a bunch of playlists with all of my videos categorized in them to make it easier for you to navigate through before i get into a review on this helmet for those of you guys want to get this helmet or these gloves uh, this Dionese winter jacket, this airbag vest to help keep you safe on the streets, my camel pants, boots gear, all of my stuff. I always include links in the description and comment section of my video. <laughs> Woo! Talk, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Talk. <laughs> you know, I'm always looking for the next better helmet. Always. Now, that's why you've seen I've done a lot of helmet reviews over the years. I've had a lot of helmets, man. <laughs> a lot of them. Uh, most of the major uh, name brand helmets I've had guys and even some of the cheaper ones And I'm always looking for a lightweight helmet because with a lightweight helmet It's less stress and fatigue, you know, it's less like a ball a heavy ball that's sitting on your head It's more a part of your head and uh, no stress on your neck or anything man That's why I love lightweight helmets. That's why my previous helmet that I had the next XR2 carbon helmet was uh, super lightweight as well I really like the helmet, but there was some negatives to the helmet, um, and that's why I was looking for an even better helmet. And that's how I came across this brand new Scorpion EXO R1 helmet. This is the Batista edition, by the way. Alvaro Batista, who is a superbike racer, uh, he wears this helmet actually. And there's also another edition of this uh, that Fabio Quattarero, a MotoGP rider. He wears that helmet. Uh, this helmet was actually des uh, engineered and designed uh, to be used in MotoGP, but yet you can ride with it out here on the streets. I'll tell you, this actually has a better viewing angle than that next XR2. The next XR2 carbon helmet that I had, it was more for, it was designed specifically for a sport bike only. So you had to be in a tough position you know to get the full viewing angle when you're sitting up right you did kind of lose a little bit of uh you know a view as where this one you get viewing all angles you get in the tuck position you got the excellent view upright sitting you know i'm straight up right right here full view guys and uh that's what i love about it but more than anything super lightweight guys three pounds and two ounces on my scale I tell you, that, that is super lightweight for a Scorpion helmet, man, I'll tell you. And this is a medium, by the way. There's three shell sizes. Uh, extra small to medium is one shell size. Large is another shell size. And then extra large and up is the third uh, shell size. Uh, so, you know, they do run true to size. I normally wear a medium. And this medium fits absolutely spot on. One thing I've always loved about Scorpion helmets is they were super comfortable to me. I had a lot of Scorpion helmets in the past, man. And uh, like I said, the drawback for me in the past was they tend to be a little heavier. But this one, they changed the game with this one, man. Uh, the material that they use is fiberglass, amaranth, and a poly resin that makes it it's super strong but lightweight and it has the best impact dispersal and also what i love about this helmet is pretty quiet i wear earplugs though i tell you there's no such thing as a quiet helmet always wear those earplugs i have a link to the ones i've been using since 2012 they're disposable foamies and they work absolutely amazing another thing i really love about this helmet is that it comes with the tinted shield and also it comes with the pin lock shield as where a lot of other premium helmets, you that you have to pay extra for that. Also, another great thing is that the shield can be opened up in incremental stops, so you can crack the shield just the perfect amount. It feels like a pillow around my face right now. Uh, but what I really love also about this helmet is that you can tailor the cheek pads to your face because it has a pump system. It has like a ball on the inside of the chin bar. And uh, all you do is you press it and it pumps the cheek pads up so that the 
cheek pads contour to your face perfectly but if you want to get thinner cheek pads you can pay extra and get the thinner cheek pads but you really don't need it with the pump system man by the way it has uh some vents a vent on the front chin uh chin bar here and it has one in back of the chin bar where you you can close it so no air comes through to your mouth and also has a, a it has a vent here up top three position uh, vent here and it has four exhaust vents in the back and I'll tell you guys it provides a good airflow right now it's it's about 45 degrees out here and I can feel a nice breeze across my face it's not too much and it's not too little it's just right but I will tell you guys you need to put the pin lock insert on your shield because right now I have the tin advisor on without the pin lock and I'll tell you it stops it does fog up but when I put on the clear shield that has the pin lock inserted uh, no fogging whatsoever also it has a lip tech 2 quick release face shield mechanism that allows for quick and easy face shield changes and also it has a center lock I tell you guys this helmet is perfectly man super aerodynamic air flows over it like butter perfect yeah, yeah, baby. <laughs> I'm a YZ, baby. Out here on the highway. <laughs> air just flows right over it, baby. Every way. Look at that. Every way. Air flows over it perfectly. <laughs> and also, by the way, it has a bunch of other features, by the way, as well. The shield has a 95% protection against UVA, UVB sun rays. Uh, also, it has an anti-scratch coating on the shield. It comes in high vis. Like I said, this is a special edition. When I have a link to this one in the description and comment section of this video, it also comes in solid colors. I think white and your classic black. And uh, like I said, there's some. Uh, there's two other special editions as well. Um, but I'm really digging this helmet. This is by far the best Scorpion helmet that I've had so far. Which, by the way, this helmet does have emergency cheek pad removal. Trust me, you want to have that because if something happens to you out here, you want to be able to have the emergency uh, responders to be able to pull those cheek pads off and safely take your helmet off. Also, this helmet comes with speaker pockets for a Bluetooth system, and it comes with a chin curtain. Now, I know you're thinking, Psycho Cruiser, how can I use this helmet for motor vlogging? Look at that tiny little space and the vent switches in the way. Well, where there's a will, there's a way, and I found a way. Very simple and easy, and you don't need a special mount. You can just use your GoPro Hero mount. I'm going to do a future video on this, so I'll stay tuned. Uh, but the way I did it, the vent switch still goes up and down, no problems. And it's on there absolutely solid with no issues, as you see with this motor vlog. As far as any other cons of this helmet, I'd say probably the look of it, if you look at it, looks a bit bigger than, say, the next XR2 helmet that I had. This is pretty much on par like with the uh, with the Showy X14 helmet. The si the shape of it, every the size and shape of it. And I think that's who they're trying to compete with really. But you're getting a much better deal with this helmet and you're getting a really safe helmet with this. Even though it's not Snell approved, like I said it is DOT and ECE approved and designed for MotoGP and used in MotoGP. <laughs> like I said, Fabio, uh, that rides at MotoGP actually wears his helmet so thumbs up so far I'll give a long-term review on it link to get this helmet and other colors in the description and comment section of this video along with my other gear get that airbag vest that's gonna help keep you safe guys this is like a life your life vest out here to help keep you safe and save your life out here man but anyways don't forget to subscribe to my all-in-one motorcycle channel deuces thumbs up check out my playlist for new riders and popular videos don't forget to comment and subscribe and check out my other channel book out motor where i customize a van for my motorcycle so i can live in my van with my motorcycle and travel across the country anywhere subscribe to my youtube channel book out moto